Hello there, beautiful. While shouting Allah Akbar or God is great in Arabic, they started in on whoever they found. These are violent, disturbing images. Cookies and people of the internet, shoelace seem interior Stacy here, of course. This video is brought to you by OpinionOutpost.com. The link to their site will be in the description down below. I'll put the name of the site right here. What this website is, is a opinion-based survey website. Now, one of the really, really common sort of ways of earning money on the internet is advertised as doing surveys, really. And a lot of people are aware that a lot of these survey websites are not legitimate. Well, this survey website is one of the leading ones with legitimacy that I in the past had actually used to earn some spare money here and there. All you have to really do is set aside like 30 minutes to an hour. A lot of these surveys will tell you in the beginning how long they actually are to complete in estimation. And what you can get through doing these surveys is Amazon gift cards, iTunes cards, and cash in general. It's a really it's a really good thing to try if you want to try it out. I'm sorry to those of you who are under 18 years of age. They only distribute these things to people who are 18 years of age and above for legitimacy of a survey opinion for the most part from my awareness at least since a lot of these questions have pertaining to things like living in a household and more adult kind of based ideas that they want to get from consumers. A lot of these surveys are also geared towards big name companies and stuff like that. So your opinion does matter and I thought that you guys would like to be aware of something like that that's around. I shared this in the past actually in another video to those of you who may not be aware of it. There you go. I just wanted to address a topic for I want to say the types of people who feel like they need to place themselves on a pedestal for whatever reasons I notice this is something that people like to use to put other people down since I find this mildly amusing to myself and it kind of goes with the notion of opinions. This is something that actually is in fact not an opinion at all. It is some illogical stigma surrounding the notion of people who like to appreciate the naked body or even not even the naked body just skin skin showing in general that one is subjective to being an attention whore for pertaining to such actions it's literally the same reason for posting your starbucks latte or frappe or whatever you're appreciating and posting a picture of the reality is you are an attention whore too if you or whoever you I'm just generalizing with you if you are seeking attention by saying such things to make yourself look higher than other people like there's no need to make one more superior than the other because it's still attention whoring like there's nothing wrong with attention whoring I don't understand why there must be a negative connotation behind it to belittle the concept of attention whoring. It's human nature <laughs> to want attention. Some people want attention to a higher degree than other types of people. Some some types of people they just prefer low-key attention, but everybody needs attention to some point. Like this. I'm, I'm showing attention to you people who clearly want attention, who are stating <laughs> that it, there is something wrong with being an attention whore for showing skin. I don't, I don't know what these people expect 
other people to see them as because you aren't seen as anything different just for stating your opinion. Like the reality is, you're stating your opinion that in fact blatantly reads that you are just a rude idiot, really. Just like me calling you a rude idiot. However, I have a base of logic and these people really do anger me. Like, I, I don't physically understand this this idea that people have to use against other people it, it's not even necessary and like i'm not making this this ramble as kind of me like unleashing whatever flame from someone targeting me for whatever reason it's just i i repetitively see this on many walks of social media and then in reality at the same time too I know I have heard people use this sort of negative outlook towards one who likes attention for whatever reasons if you are allowed to ask for attention by by stating your opinion then anybody else is allowed to ask for attention in any other way that they'd like to like it's it's freedom it's it's expression it's it's to each their own like i i get that you you may not appreciate the exposure of people's bodies however you're not one to say whether it be a negative thing or not it's it's just, it's you. <laughs> That's your problem. <laughs> and, and your problem is blatantly obvious based off of saying something like, well, I'm not a detention whore, I don't post scantily clad photos on the internet, or I don't wear scantily clad type, type of garb. It, it's really, it, it's just, it's, you look worse than the naked people, bruh. <laughs> at least, at least the naked people aren't harming y'all. But that, this kind of goes along with my own personal view of how I feel about nudity. Though at the same time, too, it is logical. It's not exactly my personal view. It's my personal view to display my nudity. However. It is not my personal view to say that nudity is something that which in fact has been degraded among society for completely illogical reasons. And, and then people flat out over, over get worked up over their, their body presentation for these sorts of notions. Like, I mean, I understand being like professional and stuff like that and distractions and all of those were really created because of mankind and mankind's views and ideas now i understand you cannot remove societal views and ideas however one can educate to bring others to an understanding of such ideas really so instead of saying nothing and ignoring all of these people saying these things, negative directions of misunderstanding, the actual idea projected, what one can do is in fact educate, so, you know, we can evolve and move on to things that are a lot more important in life, because really, I do understand that what I'm talking about is not very important. However, it is a very kind of annoying thing that a lot of people, for some strange reason, like to bring to light. So I'm just gonna bring this to light and just... If, if you like this video, share it with somebody. If you think this applies to somebody, share it with them. Anywho, I love you guys. Stay awesome. It's all hell is cookies should be. And I will see you in my next video.
is great in Arabic. They started in on whoever they found. These are violent, disturbing images. At least three of the five men killed were rabbis, including one from Boston, one from Detroit.